When's the last time you saw a truck crash? Oh, yesterday. L yesterday evening. Well, we have this bridge that's been here in Kirkland for many decades, like 80 years. And uh, it was in the last decade converted from being an actual railroad bridge to being a pedestrian and bicycle trail. Robert, you just so happen to live directly across from the truck eating bridge. Yes, uh, and I've been here for two years. How do you know when it happens? First, you'll hear a grinding metal crunch and also what sounds like thunder, a rumbling, but you'll feel it too. It's, it shakes the ground. You'll hear the sirens every now and then as they cordon off the area. Well, it seems to be increasing. It used to be just a few times a year. Once a week for a major crash, but probably every other day for a small minor crash. I would wager this bridge has probably seen at least 2,000 trucks hit it. It's a very difficult problem. Removing it would be very expensive, and the city council has decided that there are other safety projects that are higher priority, especially when we have seven brand new signs in both directions. Well, it's been kind of a community pet project because we've all been sitting back and just watching truck after truck crash into it and create damage to their trucks, to their lives to that bridge too. But a little cognitive psychology never hurts. Just dug a old banner out of a dumpster, did a little guerrilla safety tactic and hung it up and it's been working, at least on this side. We need another one on the other side.